TFNN. Headline News Update. Here's Tom O'Brien. Welcome back. Welcome, folks. Uh, we had the Dow Industrials finished down 202. You had the NASDAQ down 17. S&Ps are off 12. Little volatility coming into the close, but uh, this baby uh, came back uh, quite a way. We had the, to finish out, you had the Dow Industrials finished down 7 tenths of 1%. Uh, S&Ps down 4 tenths, and the NASDAQ uh, only down, NDX only down 2 tenths. Gold contract, gold contract down $11.40, trading at 12.87 an ounce. We had silver down 15 cents, fifteen dollars ten cents an ounce. Light sweet crude up seventy two cents, fifty six dollars fifty two cents a barrel. And notes and bonds still continue to want higher price, lower yield. You had both of them today. Reject lower price, had lighter volume. They take off top side. We had the ten year up seven ticks, one twenty one twenty seven. Thirty year up seventeen ticks. 144.11 and King Dollar. King Dollar gave it up by coming into the close. It's going to be interesting watching King Dollar here. Uh, it actually had a close under the 96.425 to 475 to be a failure. But what we had is this King Dollar was up 75 ticks, 96.525. If we get over and we take a look at King Dollar, what you're going to see is that you did light contract volume, we did 16,000 contracts. Um, gave it up coming into the close, but an actual failure would have been 96.475. We're at 96.525. Uh, that being said, uh, it doesn't mean in the next uh, 15, 20 minutes that we can't get underneath that, because what they did do is that they sold that coming into the close. We have the euro trading at 113.42 to 1 US dollar. The yen is at 170, 111.70 to 1 US dollar. And the pound is at 131.76. If we do go over and we take a look at that yen, what you're going to see is that once that yen got above a buck ten, it's going to kind of been hanging there, and that does make a difference uh, for the gold market in general. Uh, we got to 111, um, 112 today. We got to 112 and it gave it up. Now we'll see whether this yen wants to try to get back inside 111.13. That would be the number if it got back inside that 111.13. That you'd see that okay, now you get another failure at the high. Uh, bottom line, that would be put some juice into the gold market. Recap out here, we had the Dow Industrials down 205, NASDAQ off 17, S&P's down 12.5. Come right back. <music>